Hey everybody. Have a look at this. It's a tornado watch for the following counties. We're seeing Georgia counties. Counties in South Carolina. Now to keep just keep in mind we are actually located I'm actually located in Mecklenburg County, North Carolina. Lancaster, South Carolina, that's the closest one I've seen so far. Tornado watch. As you see, it's telling you it's affected to a certain time. Notice, there was no North Carolina counties m mentioned in this alert. And from what I understand, when it comes to TV distribution, such as like Time Warner Cable, you have Time Warner offices based, like, more or less based in each county. For example, all Mecklenburg County is served by Time Warner Cable Charlotte. And you go over to Gaston County, that section of Time Warner is actually by um, Time Warner Cable Gaston County. So these alerts get, from what I understand, get distributed from the central office in the county. So I'd like to know why we're seeing alerts for a tornado watch not even in this area. This has been playing for about two hours now. So I'm going to explain what this is. This is a cable card TV device. And it's Seaton Infinity TV 4. And this is one of Media Center. Now I can't really blame all, I can't put all the blame on Windows Media Center for this because it's not really, really Media Center's fault. And I can't put the blame on Seton because Seton in, the in their latest firmware they are putting an option to disable this completely. What this is doing is it automatically changes the channel to this EAS Details channel. Regardless of what you was doing you could have been recording a TV show and it would just cut your recording off with this. Now when these um Alerts are showing severe things like, let's say, tornado warnings, severe thunderstorm warnings, flash flood warnings, that kind of stuff. Yeah, they're pretty useful. But the thing is, they keep running over and over and over and over and over and over and over again for hours on end, and you can't cut them off. That's where I can lay some blame on Windows Media Center. You can't just X out this alert. It just keeps running and running and running. There's nothing you can do about it. Notice at the end you saw the TWC, so it's Time Warner Cable that distributes this alert. And I'd like to know why they are showing a tornado watch. Why they're showing a tornado watch for an area that's not even here. Like I mentioned, this is Mecklenburg County, North Carolina. And they're showing, I mean, all, the only places that are being shown here are South Carolina and Georgia for counties that are under the tornado watch. So while I'm at it, here is the radar on weather.com. And just I'll go and refresh it, just make sure everything is um, set forth. Now, I know the um, National Weather Service did have a tornado watch out earlier today that was originally supposed to run till 10 o'clock. But let me go ahead and just look up Lancaster, South Carolina. There's no tornado watch here. That's because the National Weather Service canceled that alert ahead of time because the thunderstorms done past the area about four hours ago. These right here are the thunderstorms <laughs> that originally um, were the reason the watch was issued in the first place. Those storms have well moved off. And the National Weather Service has canceled the alert, obviously, because the Weather Channel would have would stop showing it when it's canceled. But yet as I am speaking, Windows Media Center continues to show this alert. And I can close out Media Center and restart it. And within a minute or so, it'll show it again. Just keeps looping it over and over and over again. So I'm, I'm definitely not very happy about this. Why are they showing alerts um, for a tornado watch that has long expired, it was canceled early, let alone show me alerts for places that are not even here. I mean, they're showing me alerts for South Carolina and Georgia. But yeah, what do you think about that? How ridiculous.